Hi, this is Shivara Jaya from VitalCoaching.com. We are talking about breakups for men and the topic for this specific video is this is a battle for personal sovereignty. We are going to heat up a bit, uh, bring in a bit more passion and fire in this video because I want you to wake up to realize really what's going on in the breakup dynamics. When you are in the breakup zone, your life is under attack. You have been in a relationship with a person and in the process of doing that, you have been giving away part of your power to that person and receiving part of her power. It means that there is an interaction that starts happening between two hum human beings where there is a transfer of energy happening. When you are back to being single, what's very important is to reclaim, to recover control over your life. Start regaining your power, start regaining control over your thoughts, your emotions, your feelings, where you are at. I'm going to be a bit radical here in terms of showing you what it is, what it means to be in the battle mode when it comes to break up. The idea of sovereignty or supremacy over your life is very, very important because you are the king, you are the owner of your existence. Nobody has the right to tell you what to do, to control you, to direct you. In terms of you in connection with, with your own spirit, your ex is out there. She's no longer directly involved in your life. And so in the process of doing that, don't let her take control over your life. Don't let her direct what you do, the choice that you make. You want to date new women, go for it. You want to recover your power, your energy, and be back in the throne, be back in the control seat of your life. And so this is what we call sovereignty. You get back the crown of your existence. You get back the control seat. And so when we do that in the breakup zone, whether you are a man or a woman, it doesn't matter. The idea is very simple. It is that you take back control. You are the one who is flying this thing which you call your life. And so imagine this simple thing right now. Who is sitting on this chair? Who is watching this video? It's you, a human being, a certain body, a certain mind, a certain personality connected with the spirit. That person is you. That person has the right for self-determination, has the right to make your own choices. So any form of influence that misguides you or misleads you in this process is something that you want to check and gain back control of. A breakup is a very tricky thing to do, a very tricky thing to navigate. And the core idea, the core mindset, the core thing that is going to get you back into, in track with your life, with your evolution, is to take back control. So I'm going to take this radical idea even one step further. Imagine that your ex would not be in your mind at all. Imagine, imagine that all the memories of what you shared has been wiped out, out of your life. It'll be like, what's the problem? There is no problem left. The only place where there is tension and difficulty and challenge are the places where your mind remembers the past. And so in a way, you know, if we take that one step further, the goal, the ultimate goal is to get her out of your mind. Especially if that presence is extremely toxic in your field. Especially if she comes up with, you know, demands, pressure and nastiness and, and shadows and, you know, all sorts of things. What are you going to do about it? You want to gain back control. The process of gaining back control, it means like clearing your mindset and removing her out of your mind. So I know that what I'm saying here is radical. But this is what it can take sometimes to regain your power. And sometimes you are not going, of course, you know, this is theoretical. Sometimes she's going to stay there present in your mind, but no longer influence negatively your choices, no longer have a negative impact. Her presence in your mind is no longer going to drain you, and, but the, the power that she used to have over your life has been removed, has been revoked. I no longer give you permission to tell me what to do. We are no longer lovers, we are no longer partners. It might also be something more radical. It's stay away from me. Get out of my life. It might be ra radical, especially if that person is toxic. Especially if she's unstable or dangerous to be around. 
You have to realize that this is your life. You are the king. You are the owner of your existence. And so you see what I'm giving you here is not a therapeutic approach. What I'm giving you right here in this video is power. The call for you to reclaim this, which is your life. You're in the breakup zone. What are you going to do about it? Are you going to victimize? Let the circumstances swallow you into shadow mode for months or years? Or are you going to fight? Are you going to wake up and be like, this is my life. I don't give permission to anybody to take it away from me. I'm the owner of this existence. I want to be happy and move on as soon as possible towards a very bright future, bring back new women into my life, create new partnership, new bonding, new coupling. I am free. I am emotionally free. My ex is out. You know, this is, this is a radical mindset. You know, keep that in mind. I'm giving you an option. This is a tool. This is an embodiment of something that can come into your life right now. It's claiming back sovereignty over your life. It's saying, I'm the one who is in charge of my existence. Nobody controls me. I am the designer of my life. I am free.